Hi everybody, Maestro Bruno. Well, as we go through our tour, I wanted to just highlight a few bees out of today's collection of 25 and just kind of give you an idea of some of the things that you can experience. This particular one here is 1998. The pianos built in the 90s just had a tremendous amount of power. This one's a level three and it just has that just a tremendous amount of power but it still has now I want to move down to probably one of the best bees that probably is in the world this is a level five, what we call traveling virtuoso. This piano has approximately 60 hours of technical work over a period of two years. It has to be one of the sweetest. Extremely fast. This is the kind of piano with a level five that you can play quadruple pianissimo and you can play extremely fast. Now, we're going to go all the way down and show you something quite interesting because everybody may think, well, I don't have the budget for pianos that Maestro Bruno sells. So I wanted to show you, we're going to swing around a little bit and I wanted to show you a 1960, just an incredible piano. The case is not the greatest and we're not going to refinish it because what I wanted is to be able to bring to the market a level two 1960 at $30,000. Something where soundboard, action in great condition, we will calibrate this piano to a level 2, 30,000. Now here's one, I'm going to ask our photographer to just zoom in a little bit closer on this one. I purchased this piano and the lady that I purchased it from was probably in her 80s, but what was interesting is she never opened the lid and part of the reason I could tell that is well she told me that but also you could see on the top of the lid where she had placed a lot of pictures and everything but when I look at the inside of the piano the strings glisten like they're brand new and the soundboard is just absolutely perfect now the piano is a 1978 but when you talk about strings that don't have any dust, any dirt, any rust, and you have power, you hardly find that on a 1978. Now we're going to go down here, and this particular piano, high gloss, 2013. I'm thinking that we'll calibrate this to a level four, but we can do this to a level three for you or a level five. It has that This piano's been hardly played at all. It just needs 
three or four hundred hours of playing and just a good calibration to say a level three. Now this is quite an interesting one. This is a 1910 and this particular piano has been totally rebuilt. I mean completely new Steinway hammer shanks flanges, new Steinway whippins, new strings, calibrated to a level three. <laughs> in a very affordable price range. So that's six pianos right there that we just wanted to highlight. But as you can see, pretty much if you like high gloss, if you like low gloss, if you like something from the 40s, something from the 50s, something from the 60s, the 70s, 1986 here, if you need something from the 90s, we have a 98, a 96, a 95, a 94. We have a 1990 coming in. If you need something from the 2000s and newer, we have those also. So really, if you want the best experience in finding a Steinway B that speaks to you, call me. Let's talk about your new Steinway B. I'm Maestro Bruno with concert pianos.